Greetings, dear viewers, and welcome back to our enriching dialogue. I sincerely hope your day is unfolding with delight. In our most recent video, we embarked on a journey through the 15 best states for optimizing the potential of your social security benefits. Today, our exploration takes a captivating detour as we meticulously scrutinize the 15 worst states, where the value of your hard-earned money may encounter formidable challenges within the intricate realm of social security. Additionally, we will delve into recent polling data that intriguingly challenges prevalent assumptions, revealing that Americans hold a more optimistic outlook on the future of Social Security benefits than previously presumed. Before we plunge into the heart of our discussion, could I kindly ask for a moment of your time to express your support by giving this video a like? Your engagement in this simple act substantially bolsters the channel by enhancing visibility through the intricate algorithms of YouTube, and, if by chance you have yet to subscribe, consider becoming an integral part of our community for regular updates. As a gesture of gratitude, do check out the pinned comment below for links to snag a few complimentary stocks, including an exciting opportunity to grab $1.60 worth of stocks through Weeble. Now, shifting our focus to the lead story of the day, a narrative unfolding within the political sphere. The GOP is on the cusp of unveiling a new legislative proposal next week, a strategic response to recent events, notably the contentious release of the film Lady Ballers. This cinematic creation features a group of older men donning wigs to partake in women's sports, sparking fervent debates about fairness and inclusivity. In response, House Republicans are gearing up to introduce the Save Women's Sports Act, the crux of this legislation to prevent transgender women and girls from competing on female school sports teams. The proposed act emphasizes the designation of teams based on sex assigned at birth rather than gender identity, setting the stage for political divisions, especially with Democrats holding sway in the Senate. With our political compass duly calibrated, let's shift gears to a different terrain. In a recent escapade, we explored the best states for optimizing Social Security benefits. Today, our compass points us toward the 15 states that present financial challenges, as reported by Yahoo News. This comprehensive ranking takes into account pivotal factors, such as the cost of living and tax friendliness. Leading the list of financially challenging states are California, New Hampshire, and Montana. I extend an invitation for you to share your reflections on this ranking in the comments below, particularly if you call one of these states home. Now, let's navigate through a sea of optimism. Recent Gallup polling data defies common assumptions of pessimism surrounding Social Security, revealing a surprising wave of positivity among Americans regarding the program's future. Non-retirees, in particular, are displaying increased confidence, with 50% expecting to receive Social Security benefits upon retirement. This figure, which has risen from 36% in 2010, challenges the prevailing narrative of dwindling faith in the system. Additionally, retirees themselves seem confident in avoiding benefit cuts, with 53% expressing assurance. Adding a layer of complexity to this narrative is the revelation that a significant majority, 61%, would prefer an increase in Social Security taxes over curbing future benefits. This intriguing insight indicates a prevailing willingness among Americans to contribute more to ensure the sustainability of the Social Security program, currently grappling with challenges that could lead to benefit reductions if left unaddressed. As we navigate through these nuanced and multifaceted developments, it becomes increasingly essential to stay informed and engaged in the ongoing conversations surrounding Social Security. I wholeheartedly invite you to share your perspectives, anecdotes, and experiences in the comments section below. If you found this video insightful and enriching, a thumbs up would not only be appreciated, but would also contribute to the dissemination of valuable information. Don't forget to subscribe for continuous updates, and I eagerly anticipate our next meaningful discussion.